Hi everybody, this is psychologist Dr. Ari Tuckman, and I'm looking forward to doing a pre-conference this year on overcoming clients' nine negative mindsets. So this is gonna be an expansion of the session I did last year in New Orleans where we talked about motivation. So what we're gonna talk about this time is nine negative mindsets that clients tend to develop over time. So by the time someone calls an organizer, they've probably been struggling for a while, months, maybe years, maybe even decades. So it's easy under those circumstances to develop a pretty negative mindset about their ability to get organized, about the hope for the future, and to just you know have this sort of negative mindset in numerous different ways. We're gonna talk about nine different ways that those negative mindsets manifest. And the reason why this is important is no matter how phenomenal, no matter how brilliant your organizing ideas are, they're only going to be as effective as, as the client's willingness to use them in their ability to apply themselves to the task at hand. So that's where the motivation comes in. That's where the mindsets come in. And we're going to talk about specific strategies, a bunch of different strategies on how to overcome these negative mindsets and how to help your clients take a more realistic look at what their abilities are, a more real realistic look at what their situation is, and to then take a more kind of constructive approach to dealing with those, you know, very real difficulties in their life. So as much as organizers help clients with specific ideas and solutions and systems and strategies, a lot of what you're doing also is you're providing that external motivation for your clients. And in order to motivate them most effectively, you need to understand these negative mindsets. And once you understand the negative mindsets, it's then a whole lot easier to know what to do to help your clients move forward. So that's what we're talking about on this one. And I look forward to seeing everybody in Phoenix. Should be fun.